In the quiet corners of our minds, where thoughts echo and dreams take flight, we often find ourselves whispering affirmations. These positive mantras, we're told, are the keys to unlocking a better version of ourselves. But what happens when these affirmations don't work? What happens when the words we repeat to ourselves, no matter how positive, fail to bring about the change we so desperately seek? Today, we delve into the dark side of self-improvement, the shadowy realm where affirmations lose their power. But fear not, for even in the darkest night, the promise of a new dawn always lingers. Let's embark on this journey together, and remember, there are always better days to come. Affirmations, in their essence, are positive statements that we repeat to ourselves with the intention of changing our mindset, our behavior, or our life circumstances. They are a popular tool in the realm of self-improvement, often touted as a magical solution to all our problems. But like any tool, they have their limitations. When affirmations don't work, it can lead to feelings of frustration, self-doubt, and even failure. It's important to remember that this isn't a reflection of your worth or your ability to change. Rather, it's a sign that perhaps a different approach is needed. Instead of relying solely on affirmations, consider incorporating other strategies into your self-improvement journey. This video will dive into five strategies that can help navigate the often challenging terrain of self-improvement when affirmations alone fall short, providing a roadmap to resilience, growth, and a more authentic sense of self. Our first strategy is mindfulness. When affirmations don't seem to work, it might be because we're trying to overwrite our thoughts and feelings. Mindfulness, on the other hand, encourages us to acknowledge and accept these thoughts and feelings without judgment. This acceptance can lead to a deeper understanding of ourselves and can be a powerful tool for change. By being present in the moment, we can observe our thoughts and emotions without being overwhelmed by them. This can help us to respond to life's challenges in a more balanced and effective way. Our second strategy is setting realistic goals. Affirmations often focus on the end result, but the journey to get there can be just as important. By setting realistic, achievable goals, we can make tangible progress towards our larger aspirations. Each small victory along the way can provide a sense of achievement and motivation to keep going. Remember, Rome wasn't built in a day. It's the small, consistent steps that lead to significant changes over time. Next up is the practice of self-compassion. When affirmations don't work, it can lead to feelings of failure or self-doubt. Instead of beating ourselves up, practicing self-compassion means treating ourselves with the same kindness and understanding we'd offer a good friend. This can help to alleviate feelings of failure and foster a healthier relationship with ourselves. It's about recognizing that everyone makes mistakes and experiences setbacks. By being kind to ourselves in these moments, we can create a safe space for growth and learning. The fourth strategy involves seeking support. Self-improvement doesn't have to be a solitary journey. If affirmations aren't working, consider seeking support from others. This could be a trusted friend, a mentor, or a professional counselor. Sharing our experiences and gaining different perspectives can provide valuable insights and encouragement. Remember, it's okay to ask for help. We all need support and guidance at times, and there's strength in reaching out. Finally, we come to embracing change. Sometimes, when affirmations don't work, it's because we're resisting change on some level. Embracing change means accepting that growth often involves stepping out of our comfort zones. It's about being open to new experiences and ways of thinking, which can lead to profound personal growth. Change can be challenging, but it's also an opportunity for growth and discovery. By embracing change, we can learn to navigate life's ups and downs with grace and resilience. 
As we draw our exploration to a close today, let's keep in mind that self-improvement is an ongoing process, not a final endpoint to be reached. If affirmations aren't working for you, it doesn't mean you're failing. It simply means you're learning, growing, and discovering what does work for you. Thank you for joining us on this exploration. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with others who might benefit from these strategies. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more insightful content on self-improvement. We're here to support you on your journey. Until next time, remember, there are always better days to come.